Welcome back and a good Wednesday evening here uh, starting out tonight in the Denton area where you can see a few flakes, a few drops coming down here. Also, maybe uh, some blue sky off in the distance. Been kind of that type of day where we've seen just a little bit of everything. No, it's not dark yet. Remember, we uh, sprung forward on Saturday nights. Camera's not working, but what a beautiful sky around Helena right now. A lot of blue, but also some dark clouds off in the distance. It looks like this in Great Falls, still with some showers in and around town here. 45 degrees, northwest winds gusting to 26. And it's been a blustery day here for a lot of the state, mainly in the 40s. Butte America getting ready for a big day tomorrow. Current temperature in the, the mid 30s and we're at uh, 50, the warm spot up in Glasgow. Again, a blustery day, not a high wind warning criteria day, not even a wind advisory day, but yeah, if you step outside, you're likely to feel that wind. Not so much though tomorrow along the Rocky Mountain front, north central Montana, but around Helena, down through Bozeman. If anybody's heading to Butte, the wind will not be that bad, even up across the eastern part of the state. I'm in a little breeze, but really not as bad as the last few days. Friday, the wind should pick up here a bit as we see a little trough pass through the area. So activity here on the radar, uh, this activity uh, largely diurnal, meaning that it's active during the daylight hours and then it settles down as the sun goes down. Really uh, the dependent on that uh, solar intensity here. Check out some of the lightning strikes up into northeast Montana two days in a row where we've had a few thunderstorms here in the state. We've had some heavy showers. So one move right across Canyon Ferry, at least the north end earlier today. Some snow showers up there at uh, Great Divide. Look at some of this uh, showery weather, really west and south of Great Falls here in between Cascade and Wolf Creek. Uh, the canyon there looking a bit so wet there uh, with some fairly intense showers, mixed rain and snow going through. Snow up on the Rocky Mountain front, some showers up here along the Marias River. That's a intense looking shower right there, right near Rocky Boy. And a few of these showers extending down into Fergus County, a mix of rain and snow around Lewistown, some snow for the big snowies and some rain showers, fairly small but intense up here in northeast Montana. You can see why we had a couple of those lightning strikes uh, just to the east of Glasgow. So here's what will happen, a continuation for the next two, maybe three hours of some showers and snow showers there closer to the mountains. And then again, as the sun goes down, so will the activity uh, in the showers. And tomorrow, just a whole lot of sunshine here across a lot of the state. Some clouds will increase late in the day, but uh, that's the next storm system. Weak storm system that will bring just a couple of snow showers to the mountains here as we get into Friday. Maybe a few mixed rain and snow showers in the lower elevations of central and western Montana. Snow, not a lot. We do need a lot more uh, for that snowpack here. Here's the forecast for tonight. So cooler than the last few nights. Many areas dropping down below the freezing point. And once again, a couple more hours of a few showers and can't rule out an isolated thunderstorm. I do not believe overnight we will have thunderstorms in Lewistown. We're in the 20s around Helena with still maybe a little snow up on the divide. Tomorrow, St. Patrick's Day. It's nice for everybody, even if you're not Irish. Temperatures in the 40s and the 50s with a lot of sunshine. Uh, so yeah, really nice day for Friday. Not too bad in the eastern part of the state. Central western Montana, some clouds, couple of mixed rain and snow showers around Saturday. Start off the weekend warm 50s and 60s. Saturday's the last day of winter. That means Sunday is the first day of spring and we could have a little sloppy wet snow mixed with some rain. I don't think it will accumulate much, but potentially into the mountains around Helena, uh, we could have a little coating of some snow or a couple of inches, but in town, I don't think much. Next week, the possibility of 60 degrees here for a lot of the state. Spring certainly is in the air.